guys, this is Lori Nordstrom with Behind the Shutter Magazine. And this month we talked about making sure every woman, and to me every person who comes into your business, feel special and unique. So I want to talk to you a little bit more about that. But first, I want to let you know that I am filming today from Ecuador. I'm here at our Don Duamor Boys Orphanage that we have here in, close to Quito, Ecuador. I'm here every few months and this is a really special place for me to be and so excuse the outside distractions. We've got even some construction going on in the background and you might hear some kids here and there. But I did want to take the opportunity to just share with you a little bit more on this subject about just making people feel beautiful in front of our camera. And for me, of course we need beautiful lighting and we need beautiful posing and we need all those technical aspects that create a beautiful portrait. But what's almost or maybe even more important to me to not only the entire experience but to that final sale is how we make people feel and making them feel beautiful, feel special, feel important, unique and, and that the things that they care about are just as special, just as beautiful are something that are, are very important to me and so I want to share a story with you and this story this is something that happened years ago with me in my studio and now you're hearing the dog <laughs> barking but years ago in my studio I had one of my employees that I was working with I was getting ready for a session and I was in a super bad mood that day for whatever reason I don't even remember now the circumstances but I was in a bad mood and I was kind of throwing my gear together and getting ready for a session and and Debbie came to me and she said, you know, are you getting ready for a session right now? And and I said, yeah. And, and she said, well, you seem like you're in a really bad mood to me. And I told her the story, whatever was going on that day. I was like, I am, I'm, you know, I'm not in a good mood. And, and she said, will you just sit down with me for a minute? And we sat down where we were and, and she just said, you know, Lori, the sessions that we've had together with you, she had three girls and as they grew up, I had been photographing them for many years and she said, you know, these sessions are so important to me and so special to me and the images that you capture for me remind me of so many things. And it doesn't matter if the girls are fighting on the way to the session, they're throwing hairbrushes at each other and everybody's kind of grumpy and my husband's not in the best mood. You know, we get here and you stop us and you remind us why this is so important. And I love watching you photograph my girls together. I love seeing them love each other and their relationship together. I love hearing you talk about what you see in them. I love you bringing us all together and really reminding us of why we are taking the time to make sure that these memories and these moments are captured. And she said, you know what, I bet the family that's coming today is going to feel the exact same way. And that was one of the most valuable lessons for me at that time and especially at that time in my life. I had really put my business first before my family for way too long. I ended up divorced and a single mom again and really kind of had made a mess of things. Not kind of, I really made a mess of things. And you know, so this was one of those, one more, one more lessons, one more piece of the puzzle that really started putting things together for me that if we really can focus on the people in front of us, not our issues, not our excuses, not what happened this morning, not the flat tire we had yesterday, not the kids bad grade, it doesn't matter what happened, if you focus on the person that's in front of your lens, whatever you're photographing, whoever you're photographing, talk about those relationships and those personalities and what's important to them and really what brought them in front of your camera. Talk about those things and you'll be adding value to those portraits, to what you're selling to those clients. And if you're talking about relationships, if you're talking about what you're seeing in front of your camera, there's not really a price that can be put on that. When your clients are coming to view those images in their portrait viewing and order appointment, they're not telling you that costs too much. Because how can it? We're not talking about pictures, we're talking about that experience and those memories and those relationships. And there's not a price tag to be put on those family moments that we're creating. And if you're a wedding photographer, talk about the interaction between the couple. Talk about what you see in that couple. You know, maybe they're not all lovey-dovey, ooey-gooey, 
but you know maybe they are pranksters and jokesters and they've got all these little inside jokes that they tell comment on those things tell them what you see in them and then that's what they're going to see and appreciate in the images that you create for them and it's the same whether you're doing you know just photographing women whether you're photographing families whether you're, whether you're phot photographing kids high school seniors it doesn't matter talk about those personalities talk about what's important to them and why they are so valuable and why this moment in time is valuable for them and you will create more value for your work and for your sale for the end sale so I want to encourage you in that and I appreciate you joining me this month I will see you next month thank you for putting up with the surrounding noise uh, this month and I know you can probably appreciate the beauty it's always green and it's always beautiful here in Ecuador it's one of the things I love about getting away uh, to this spot but uh, I appreciate you and thank you I will see you next time